Welcome to CTV. Now, guys, we've just finished playing Leon, where we've just won 5-4 on penalties. And, guys, that is our last pre-season game done. And, obviously, it was at the bridge. It was nice to finish our pre-season at Stamford Bridge, obviously. Now, guys, I'm just going to quickly run you through what the starting eleven was and discuss it with you guys. Because um, I obviously didn't do a live team lineup before the game. Um, so, Bulka started in goal. Very interesting choice, obviously, because... Um, he obviously hasn't put Cabello back out. I don't know whether he's saving him for the season for Saturday because if we get a new goalkeeper in um, before Saturday, will they be quite ready? That's in question. So maybe he's saving Cabello for Saturday against Huddersfield and then obviously maybe that new goalkeeper that's in question might hopefully come out if he signs. Um, but I'll talk about that another day. That's a video for another day, hopefully tomorrow. And then in defence, Zappa Costa and Padu Christiansen and Palameri. So he completely changed up the back line. And Padu's played um obviously in a pre-season game, but it was great to see Christiansen, Palameri and Zappa Costa join him and get a run out. Um <coughs> and then Bakioko, Danny Drinkwater, Loftus Cheek, Moses, Abraham and William. Now can I just say it was really good to see Sarri put out um, a different range of players, um, mixing it up, because obviously in our pre-season games, we've been going with uh, the same, similar players, which have been up for option, because obviously people have, players have been coming back from the World Cup, but it's good to see Sarri playing out a di different mixture, just to give them their chance and sit, show their, him what they can do. Um, let's talk about Morata, obviously he was dropped tonight. Um he gave him his chance in the community shield and he blew it. So, obviously, Sarri wanted to give Abraham the chance, you know, and I don't blame him. Um, obviously, it just wasn't good enough at, obviously, the weekend in the community shield. It's going to be really interesting to see how that works out on Saturday against Huddersfield. Will Sarri decide to play Morata or not? I can't see it myself. But is Giroud going to play is back to where you know we just don't know it's all in question yeah but he's obviously shown how disappointed he was with him at the weekend by not picking him tonight because there'd be no reason not to start him um i am so loving savvy's interest in the youth obviously and padu ruben off his cheek um abraham it was it's also been great all of this pre-season to see him play in the youth. I always go on about the youth on my channel, how important it is to blood them through the first team system. It's so important and I love seeing that as a Chelsea fan personally. Um, let me know down below all your thoughts and opinions on that, guys. Do you guys love um, the interest Savvy's having in the youth? Because I certainly do. That's one factor I am Seth can't even speak. Definitely loving about him. I love his interest in the youth. Um, and yeah, so obviously it ended nil-nil um, at full time. Um, it was obviously goalless, we couldn't score a goal. Um, but then in the penalty shootout, Jorginho, Barkley, Alonso and Azpilicueta scored. And then obviously our Eden Hazard obviously scored the last penalty. And can I just say, I actually t um, retweeted to Twitter um post earlier um seeing Eden Hazard back like in the Chelsea tunnel and it's so good to see him back guys we've been so worried I know deadline day is on Thursday but I can't really see anything happening now and to see him back in that ch Chelsea tunnel means freaking well to me to be honest I'm absolutely over the moon probably along with many other Chelsea fans I don't think there'll be one sad Chelsea fan seeing back in the tunnel you know everyone loves him We'd be screwed without him. Um, and obviously Diop um, missed a penalty for Leon. And it was saved by Rob Green. Um, so yeah, where's all the Rob Green haters now, guys? <laughs> um, but yeah, you know, it's... I know it's disappointing that we didn't score in, um, in like, obviously the 90 minutes. But, you know, it's pre-season. It's done now. And at least we won on penalties. Um... But yeah, it's always seemed to like come to penalty shootouts. This has like been I don't even know how many penalty shoots out out we've had in this preseason, but there's been loads and so yeah, it's finally good to see us um well, win on a penalty shootout. We have won on one of them, I think, or maybe more than one. Um, but we obviously didn't against Arsenal on that, um, which we don't need to talk about. Um but yeah, but guys, it's all there is really to say. Um Football's back on Saturday, isn't it? And 
I'm absolutely buzzing and yeah, great to win tonight. Um, obviously, pre season's a chance to see where we're going wrong and where we need to improve. So, hopefully, Savvy's picked up on that, which I'm sure he will have. Um, and hopefully, we can just move on from there and see what we can do. Um, so, yes, thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let me know down below all your thoughts and opinions on tonight's game and who your man of the match was. Also, don't forget to hit that big thumbs up if you do enjoy this video and subscribe down below if you're new to the channel. Also, guys, I bet someone's going to comment in the comments below what's that written on your hand, Emma. And it's actually Thursday deadline day. Um, so I will be covering deadline day on my channel on Thursday. So make sure to look out for that. I hopefully will be doing a um, video about our potential goalkeeper. Um, hopefully coming to Chelsea and the price and everything. And discussing all my thoughts on that tomorrow, hopefully. Also, guys, I just want to quickly say something. And I really need your opinions down below. Last season, I did live team lineups before every Premier League game, FA Cup game, etc. Um, and I did them bef like an hour before kickoff. Obviously, that was when it was released. And I just don't know if you guys want to see them anymore. Like, I know that I'm going to university and stuff in September, so it's going to be exceptionally hard for me to actually manage to do live team lineups for Chelsea. Um, and I know it's going to be. I might just not be able to do them. So I don't know whether I should start doing them and then just stop or what. But let me know down below your thoughts and opinions on that, guys. I want to know how you guys feel about it. Um, because obviously, it's it's a Chelsea channel. It's what you guys want to see. Um, so let me know down below on that and up to Chelsea. And guys, I can't wait for Saturday. My match preview will be out on Friday night for Huddersfield, which I can't wait for. And um, so yeah, and I am obviously going on Saturday, so I'll see everyone there. But um, yeah, up and chills. Thanks.